Uh, the two of you have spent uh, the past months attacking each other, calling each other uh, names, taking issue with each other's records. Uh, we hear a lot of Montanans are getting tired of these negative campaigns. Let's try to turn this around just for this question. Tell me about something you admire or like about uh, Conrad Burns, and <laughs> let's have him do the same. I think he's got a really nice wife. No, I fill us up. <laughs> I want to tell you, it, this, does, this does focus on the family, though. The truth is, is I, I, I admire the fact that uh, Senator Burns has taken uh, uh, time out of this state for 18 long years uh, to serve in Washington, D.C. This is the greatest state and the greatest country in the world, and uh, that's a sacrifice. Conrad. Well, there's not too many things that, that, uh, that you don't like about John Tester. Great guy. Really is. He reminds me of a good friend of mine that I had in the United States Senate, and he represented Minnesota. His name was John Wel or, or, uh, uh, Wellstone, Paul Wellstone. He was a uh, he was a pure he was a pure, really liberal, ultra liberal. But he really believed it, and 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 John does too. He <laughs> believes in tax and spend. And, and, and I admire that because that's only in America. Oh, wait a Quiet, minute. Quiet, please. That's only in America can you do that. And I will tell you, Paul Wellstone and I got along very, very good because his word was good and, and, we, and we, did a lot of, uh, we did a lot of legislation with each other in the Senate. So this is America. John's a great guy. His politics is wrong. 